snake looks delicious. What part do you think I'm about to eat? Uh, basically, a snake don't have parts. But um, if I had to call it anything, uh, I would say it's his knee. Great. His knee. And uh, what are we having for dessert? Squirrel. Excellent. Let's talk about Bobby playing football. I don't like it, Mr. Coach Klein. I don't like it one bit. You see, my boy is too delicate to be playing foosball or whatever you call it with them gargantuans. I don't think you understand, Mrs. Boucher. No, you don't understand me, Mr. Coach Klein. My boy is all I got left. Ow! It's the brain pain, Coach. You see, my husband, Robert, one day back in 1966, pick up sticks. Me, four months pregnant with this precious angel. He decides he wants to go and help the farm people. So he's going to go and join the Peace Corps. And he promised me that everything's going to be okay. Just like you promising me now. But everything wasn't okay. But he got lost in the middle of the Sahara Desert. And he died. He died. Don't get no water, Coach. He died of the dehydration. And we were left all alone. I would have got my daddy some water, but I just put a baby inside my stomach. And now you want to take away the only part of my Robert I had left. But don't you want the only part you've got left to get a college education? Yeah. Me, a college student? Yes. Bobby, think about it. A whole new world will open to you. Oh, no, no, that, 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 that sounds nice. Me, me, a college man? Coach, my Bobby's a sweet boy. But he ain't exactly what you call college material. So don't you go filling his simple head with all those crazy dreams of school and college and things of that sort. But mama, I'm tired of it might call me a dummy.